Does your cup of tea have 15 billion microplastic molecules in it? Hey, I'm Robin Openshaw, the Green Smoothie Girl Online, and I want to talk to you about tea. I think of tea drinkers as health-oriented people, or British people, usually the people who know that the nutrients from medicinal plants steeped in water are good for them, a calming, healthy drink people have had for centuries. I do believe that tea can be very beneficial for our health. But I want you tea drinkers to know that most brands, even of lovely organic tea leaves, might be delivered to you with tea bags made with plastics. One study showed about 15 billion microplastic and nanoplastic molecules released from one bag of tea, as the microplastics are released into the hot water, so of course you're drinking it. Another study shows that there's enough microplastics in tap water that a person would be eating the equivalent of a credit card every two weeks in molecules of plastic found in your tap water. You're probably aware that microplastics interfere with the healthy functioning of your endocrine system or your hormone system, and that we really should do what we have to to avoid them. I've previously talked about why I don't get Starbucks or other prepared coffees and teas because the plastics in the lining of the cup melt into your hot beverage before you drink it, plus those cheap plastic lids they put on the cup at Starbucks, all the hot liquid has to pass through it on its way to your mouth. Check my references to one researcher who investigated which tea brands have compostable tea bags, meaning that they're made of organic materials and will break down in your compost pile. I'm sorry to say not many of them are compostable. I confess I'm not a tea drinker, although I admire tea drinkers, and I think it's a healthy habit. So if you're going to drink tea, you might want to buy loose tea leaves in bulk and just use your own stainless steel infuser to be able to take the tea leaves out after they steep in the hot water. Apparently, even paper tea bags are made with epichlorohydrin, a carcinogen industrial solvent, to avoid the product tearing during its use. Unfortunately, that's also the case for paper coffee filters. Hate to be the bearer of bad news, but I also thought you'd want to know. I'll share the references to the 2019 study on microplastics in tea bags and the story on how tap water contains a lot of microplastics. Just click, click on the references link. My references also shares a link to our famous detoxification protocol we've now helped 20,000 people accomplish for better health. We help you eliminate a great deal of toxicity that the body holds on to until we give it some help. Thanks for following Green Smoothie Girl, and I'll see you next time.